Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video I will show you my February and March completed pages and VIPs. Mostly it will be February completed pages because in March I didn't color a lot. All my free time I played Hogwarts Legacy, so I haven't enough time for coloring in March. So let's start from March completed pages. I did two pages in Twilight Garden by Maria Trulli. First this fox. For the background I used Distress Inks. I used color Victorian Velvet and for Fox I used watercolor as the base and then I added shadows with pencils. Fox I colored with Derwent Derwent pencils. I think for flowers I used Prismacolors and for leaves I used Polychromos Sepia pencil maybe. Also I used white gouache to add the texture of white fur on the fox. I like how it turned out. Simple and a sweet page. I like this color combination. I think this muted pink looks nice with orange and brown. And then I did one more page here. I did these flowers. Honestly, I'm not like to color flowers usually, but for some reason I wanted to color flowers. I used acrylic marker for the background and I colored uh, everything with luminance and light fast pencils. Luminance it was mine pencils and light fast I tried pencils from my friend. And I like these pencils. I like how it lays down on the paper. I like the result. I like these natural colors. I'm not sure about all splatters that I added. Maybe I shouldn't add it, but still I'm happy with the result. And I'm happy that I colored this book because I don't remember when I colored it last time. This is my old book and I don't remember when I colored this book last time. I think it was a few years ago and I'm glad that I colored in this book again. So it was Twilight Garden by Maria Trolle. In this little sweet book I did one page or uh, it's half of the page. It was just for relax, nothing special. I did this half with bunnies. I think I did um, this part of the page at the summer and bunnies I did in March. Nothing special here, I just uh, wanted something relaxing and quick to color. I like this book. It's so nice and fast to color. Very cute pages. On the other side of the dream by Karolina Kubikowska. I did here a very simple double spread. So I did this one. I used Distress inks and also I added stencils with butterflies. This page was grayscale, like this. And I just added a few shades of Distress inks and I'm happy with the result. It was fun to do it. Also I added metallic watercolors. It's simple, but I like this double spread. It was fun and quick coloring. Harry Potter, a magical places and characters coloring book. And here I did 
this page it took me forever to color it this was a body color with my ukrainian friends we decided to color different characters from harry potter and we choose characters randomly and i should color harry potter i choose this page there was another background on this page and i changed it don't ask me how i did it because it's really hard to explain i colored harry potter with prismacolor pencils also for his clothes i used watercolor as the base here i added a little bit of pearlescent watercolors on the wings of these keys uh, because i wanted to make it a little bit shiny i tried to make harry looks like a real harry in the movie and i used photo reference for color his face it was picture from goblet of fire i think his hairstyle looks like in the goblet of fire movie so i decided to make him looks like in that movie and i don't know let me know in the comments below do he <laughs> looks like real harry in the movie on the background i wanted to make newspaper effect but i think i used a lot of browns it should be more like black and white but it looks pretty interesting and i'm happy with the result also i have whip here that i can't finish for a few months and i still hope that i finish it and also let me show you completed pages by another colorist so it was harry potter magical places and characters coloring book and now I will show you my completed pages for February and I will start from Morgan O'Brien books. New released Magic Mouse, a springtime coloring book by Morgan O'Brien. And I did here one page. I did this page for our color along, color with Ukraine. You can check this hashtag on Instagram. And our topic was friendship. I think uh, this page is nice representation of friendship. It's very cute. I used Posca pencils for this page mostly and a little bit of Prismacolors. I like to use Posca pencils in this book because it's uh, very smooth and soft and even on this bad paper it lays down nice. And also I used white and ivory posca markers to cover some black lines i like this page i like this book honestly morgan o'brien now it's one of my favorite artists and i hope in this spring i will color more in this book the way home a galactic coloring book also by morgan O'Brien, I have here one page that I totally messed up and um, I want to print this page again and try to color it again because I can't fix it. First I wanted to color moon light yellow color but then I decided to make it light blue and I used alcohol markers and these two colors mix together and it becomes ugly green like you can see here then I tried to cover it with Posca markers but I don't like this result and I don't want to finish this page then I have second try to color a night scene in this book and i did this page you can find on my channel the video how i did this page i used prisma colors and posca ivory marker i like this limited color palette and this time i'm happy with the result i like combination of violets and a little bit of yellow i think it really looks like a night 
and it's a really sweet and cute page spooky town by coco Bio. i thought i will color this book only on halloween i didn't plan to color it now but i remembered that here was page with girl with heart and i decided that it will be nice page to color for the valentine's day i didn't finish this page yet i did marker base and uh, then i added shadows with pencils i used prisma colors and posca pencils but i didn't finish some details for example i didn't finish these flowers there is not a lot to finish this page but i lost my inspiration i think let me show you a little bit closer I like these colors i like how bright colors looks comparing with pale pastel colors i did flowers and heart more bright and vibrant and i did girl using some pastel colors and i like how these uh, colors looks together and i hope someday i will finish this page Also, I did one more page in this book and I did this page, uh, this one I finished. It was for body color. Me with other Ukrainian colorists decided to color something in blue monochrome color palette and I colored this one. Also, it was my first try of new alcohol markers that I bought. It was Hamelon markers. There was discount in our local store and I wanted to try it. So I bought a few colors and these markers. It's not the regular alcohol markers. You have markers and also you have color tops. And using these uh, tools you can create some nice transitions from one color to another color. And this page I colored only with these markers, I think. I added a little bit of pencils on top to make shadows deeper. And also I colored this ghost with Prisma colors, but everything else is these uh, markers. Also I used white Posca and white Faber-Castell bead pen. It also was new for me. I didn't try it before, but I like it. It's not so bright white like Posca. It's more transparent white. And for some highlights, I used this marker. For more bright highlights, I used Posca marker. I like this page. I like how it turned out and it was quick to color. I like that every scene looks very gray and muted, but this ghost looks bright because I colored it with Prisma colors. I like how this ghost looks comparing with everything around. It looks like a focal point on this page. Also, I will show you pages in blue colors from other colorists. Also in this book I did this page. I tried here Hamelon markers. Here you can see this transition from one color to another. And it looks really smooth and nice. Also I added a little bit of pencils for shadows, but mostly I colored this one with these markers. And it was Spooky Town by Coco Wire. Also for the Valentine's Day I colored few pictures in the Love Spell coloring book by Moon and Hunter. You can find um, the flip through of this book on my channel if you're interested. This is small postcard size book, but I like small books because it's fast to color. And I did here this cupcake used distress ink for the background and alcohol markers and prisma colors for this cupcake 
also I added glitter gel pen on the hearts and then I cover it with glossy and also I used glitter gel pen on this love poison I think So it was Love Spell Coloring Book by Moon and Hunter. Fairy Celebrations by Clara Markova. This is my new book and it was a present that I won in the giveaway on Instagram. It was giveaway by Mandy Colors. I'm really happy to have this book. It's my first book by Clara Markova. And I just make a little cake here. I just wanted to try this paper. I tried pencils here for the background. I used Distress inks. Also I tried watercolors a little bit. I like to color something small and I like the quality of this book. The paper is nice and uh, I plan to color this page and for some reason I want to color this page using violet colors. I don't know. I see it in violet color combination. So thank you Mandy for this giveaway and I hope you will see more completed pages from this book next month. Joanna's Christmas. I started this page I think in February and I didn't finish it. I started this bunny and for the background I used watercolor around this circle and inside the circle I used Distress Ink and I have video how to make bouquet background with Distress Ink. You can find this video on my channel if you're interested. I don't know, now I haven't mood to finish this page because it more like winter page. Maybe someday I will finish it. I hope someday I will finish it, but I don't know when. For bunny I used gouache paint and for these flowers and leaves I think I used Prismacolors and maybe Faber-Castell Polychromos Indigo pencil. I don't know, I like this uh, color combination, I like that I did bunny black, I like how I did background, but I lost inspiration for this page for some reason. Another whip in A Million Sweet Scenes by Lugumeo, and here I have the same background, as I said, there is tutorial on my channel how to make such background. There is not a lot to finish this page. I colored background, I colored this uh, metallic jar, I don't know. I just need to color penguins. So I hope I will finish it. The Crimes of Grindelwald coloring book. It's from Fantastic Beasts. And here I did very simple page. I did this pattern. Honestly, this is not my favorite book because there's a lot of patterns here and also there is some grayscale backgrounds that I don't know how to color. But I decided that I can color even these patterns. I can experiment with backgrounds. Very simple page, but I'm happy with, with the result because it looks vintage. It looks like some page from the old magic book. I don't know. So I used Distress inks for the background. Then I used black ink to color all these Deadly Hallows symbols and also I added gold watercolors. Yes, it looks messy and dirty, but I like it. It's okay. And it was fun to do this page. And honestly, in this book paper is really nice because nothing bleeds through. And the last book that I will show you, it's Mickey and Friends, 
this is a Disney by number coloring book and I did here one page I did this one with Pluto I used uh, Crayola felt tip pens for this page and for light blue color I used Faber-Castell felt tip pen and also I didn't color grass on this page so here you can see there was grass on this page but I decided that I don't want to color grass it looks a little bit stretchy but it's okay usually I color these books with pencils but with felt tip pens it also looks okay so it was my completed pages and whips for February and March. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please let me know in the comments below which completed page you liked more. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.